Hey everyone, Mark here from Pine Tech. Today we're going to be showing off a couple versions of my compact holster for the Hellcat Pro. Uh, the first one here is going to be more of a base model, just the 10 degree cant, which is my most popular cant. So if you're new to concealed carry, that 10 degree cant, um, just instead of being straight up and down, it just tilts the gun forward. So if you wear it on your hip, it helps conceal this handle so it prevents it from printing. Uh, and up front, and my personal carry is a Glock 19. Uh, with the 10 degree cant, but I wear it appendix. I actually do like that little bit of twist up front because I don't think that it adjusts my angle to draw severe enough where it changes it, but it does help hide that larger handle right inside uh, my stomach there so it doesn't print at all, even in the summertime with just a shirt on. So uh, my compact holster, quick little overview. We got the two uh, adjustable retention screws, the one and a half inch belt clip, uh, finishing washers throughout, and then we got some little rubber washers to help alleviate the pressure of taking the stain on and off all day long. And then two nice thing to note is you hear, if you, you pull up on that belt clip, you get a nice snap. That's just, there's pressure against the Kydex. You don't want anything that's like a little bit just kind of hanging up there because that creates an area for your belt to slide through. Then you put this over your belt, it grabs onto it and it bites. Uh, we're gonna take a quick look here. Uh, if you're new to Pine Tech or my holsters, uh, I pride myself on just kind of the simplicity, but the design of my holsters. Um, each one's kind of like a little bit of a work of art for me. Um, you know, not not a lot of just straight lines and quick belt sander kind of things. I like to add curves to each shape of the gun. So uh, underneath the trigger guard here, nice and flush with the bottom of the trigger guard. Along the back, we're enclosing the magazine release so you don't get any accidental uh, uh, mag, mag release presses and have a loose mag. Uh, we got Kydex up to the back of the slide. And then we'll just give you a nice little slow, slow mo look of the holster and how it's going to sit in the gun there. And that adjustable retention down here makes it real nice. You can have it just slide right in or, or bite and have a nice firm uh, pull. That's up to you. All right, so this is my basic, um, if you go to the website, just order a basic compact holster. This is basically what you get. Uh, now there's a couple options here. Uh, so I guess a lot of questions on some of these. I recently added the monoblock uh, clip as an option for a belt clip. Um, I really like this. I had a lot of people ask me for it. So I put it on my own holster and wore it for a, a couple months to see if I liked it. I don't typically, I don't make things that I won't personally wear. That's kind of a, a rule of, of what I like so uh, but yeah it's it's a great it's a great clip it's got a lot of bite to it it's got these two little points it moves a little bit yeah it's a nice clip uh, this one also has the claw on it um, whenever I make a holster that has a claw on it if the barrel length is long enough and if I can fit it in I always like to put a third retention point in there just because this belt this hits the back of your belt to keep it tight against your body and that causes a little more movement down in this area. So I like to add the third claw to keep everything nice and tight, to keep these screws from wobbling or backing themselves out of the posts. Now, ultimately, what I would recommend is once you find the settings for retention that you like and the snap, when you find your personal liking, throw some blue Loctite in there and that way you don't ever have to forget, uh, worry about losing a screw or, you know, or needing replacement hardware. And that's not just with my, I recommend that for any holster. So whatever brand you choose to, to purchase, do that. Find your setting that you like. Blue Loctite, just in case in the future you do need it to remove it in the emergency, uh, you'll be able to remove it. So anyways, back to this one. Uh, essentially the same setup as this. You just got the mono black clip and the claw. And this one's set up with a, a straight, straight cant. So this is going to be prime um, concealed carry. Probably a lot of people are going to order this for the appendix carry uh, for this particular setup. So there we go. A couple versions of my compact holster. You can see these or check them out. www.pinetech.com. Uh, uh, give me a like, a like, and a subscribe on this channel would be much appreciated. Um, I do do uh, Instagram, so if you want to check me out on Instagram, it's just Pine Tech as well. Uh, I really appreciate you guys watching the video, taking the time. Thank you.